Looking live over downtown Norfolk for the first time, we're hearing from the interim police chief about what the department is doing to try and tackle crime. More than a dozen people have been shot downtown this year. Tonight, Chief Michael Goldsmith joined several city council members to discuss solutions with the Downtown Norfolk Civic League. Allison Basil tells us more. Norfolk City leaders have hit the streets literally in search of solutions to violence in the downtown area after a recent shooting sent four people to the hospital. I've walked up and down Grammy Street to physically smell, see, feel and hear exactly what's going on. Downtown Norfolk Civic League leaders are calling for an earlier closing time for bars and restaurants. Councilwoman Courtney Doyle agrees. So will everybody have to close at midnight? I think I personally still support that. I know many of the shootings have taken place after midnight, not before midnight. Andrea McClellan says any new regulations need balance. We have to be very careful about is not to be so heavy handed that we hurt everybody. When it comes to safety improvements, Norfolk Interim Police Chief Michael Goldsmith says his department is pulling out all the stops. We are definitely coloring us on the lines. Goldsmith says the department is beefing up patrols along Granby Street and surrounding areas. Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday nights, uh, we've got extra folks showing up to patrol between 7 in the evening and 3 o'clock in the morning. Chief Goldsmith says the department is investing heavily in security cameras. Looking at buying the back end software that will allow us to tie those cameras together. So far, he says safety enhancements are helping police officers get more suspects behind bars. And if we can't make the arrest on the spot, we make the arrest very quickly after that. While police try to tackle crime, Councilwoman Doyle says city leaders are doing their part to keep businesses in line. But the code enforcement efforts and the zoning and the permitting and the conditional use permit reviews is ongoing and very deep. I talked with several downtown business owners about the plan to close at midnight. A few owners tell me they don't think the time change will help and say that plan isn't fair. In Norfolk, Allison Basil, 13 News Now. Chief Goldsmith says he is also looking to invest in cameras that can read license plates. Tonight's meeting follows a string of shootings in the downtown area. In March, five people were shot outside of Chicho's Backstage Pizza on Granby Street. Three of them died. Two weeks later, three people were shot at MacArthur Center. And earlier this month, four people, including a sheriff's deputy, were shot outside Legacy Restaurant and Lounge on Plume Street. 